is a Japanese manga series written and illustrated by Tite Kubo. Bleach follows the adventures of Ichigo, Kurosaki after he obtains the powers of a soul reaper, a guardian of souls in Japanese culture. As a result of his ability, he can fight evil spirits known as Hollows. Between August 20, 2001 and August 22, 2016, 74 volumes of the manga were published in Shuisha's weekly Shonen Jump. In addition, Bleach has been adapted into an anime series produced by Studio Piro and directed by Noriyuki A. The first episode premiered in Japan on October 5, 2004. In the wake of Bleach Thousand Year Blood Wars release, we looked at and rated the Bleach film franchise, including animated and live-action films, from worst to best. Unfortunately, Bleach movies are considered non-canon and are mainly what-if scenarios, as with many popular anime series. Kabachiwa.com presents Bleach Movie Ranking. Number 6. The Sealed Sword Frenzy <laughs> In this OVA, the Shinigami Bation, sealed by the Soul Society long ago, has been set free. Ichigo encounters him on a fateful day, and nearly half of his Riyatsu is drained. It is now up to Ichigo and the Soul Society to prevent Bation from completing his destructive mission. There is no doubt that the Soul Society arc is the most enjoyable adaptation. The animation quality has improved significantly since the series debuted in 2006. Most of the characters appear to be more lifelike than their manga counterparts. Number 5. Bleach Live Action <laughs> This movie was released in Japan on July 20, 2018. It was produced by Warner Brothers, based on the manga series of the same name by Tight Kubo, and directed by Shinsuke Sato, a Japanese teenager with the power to see ghosts must fight evil spirits and help lost souls find their way to the afterlife. Number 4. Diamond Dust Rebellion Since the beginning of time, legend has told of an epic battle. Diamond Dust Rebellion, which was released in 2007. The film is directed by Noriyuki Abe and co-written by Michiko Yokote and Masahiro Okubo. The main plot of this movie is about an all-out battle that ensues to retrieve a stolen artifact with mysterious powers. But unfortunately, while Ichigo treats Toshiro's wound, a mysterious crowd attacks them at their location. The mysterious crowd reveals that they are after a powerful artifact known as the Soul King's Seal. Number 3. Memories of Nobody The first film in the series was released on July 14, 2006. It was directed by Noriyuki Abe and written by Masashi Sogo. In this movie, Ichigo follows Sena while Rukia returns to Soul Society, searching for answers. While pursuing Sena, Ichigo meets Soul Society's envoys on Earth to investigate the mysterious reflections of the human world that appear in Soul Society. Number 2. Fade to Black That I'm standing here today. If you don't remember me, that's fine. But I will still protect you! This is the third film in the Bleach series, released in 2008. The film was directed by Noriyuki Abe and written by Masashi Sogo, who adapted the story from Tite Kubo's manga. In the movie, Ichiko Kurosaki again enters the Soul Society to save Rukia Kachiki from two spirits with a history with the character. They erase Rukia's memories and the Goatee I-13, the military forces that protect Soul Society, now view Ichiko as a threat. Before we move on to number one, are you enjoying our content? If so, please like, share, subscribe, and follow. And do not forget to visit Kabachiwa.com for all the latest on anime and kava culture. Number one, the Hellverse. I'm about to open the gates of hell. You better prepare yourselves. They took his sister. 
It is the fourth installment in the Bleach franchise and was released in 2010. Directed by Noriyuki Abe, the screenplay was written by Natsuko Takahashi and Okubo Masahiro, with Tai Kubo, author of the manga, overseeing the production. As the film's plot unfolds, Ichigo Kurosaki and his friends traverse hell to save his younger sister Yuzo from harm. So there you have it, our ranking of the Bleach movies. Which one is your favorite? Comment below and tell us what you think. Be sure to also visit our website at kavachiwa.com for the latest on all things anime and kava culture related. Thanks for watching and hope you enjoy your foray into the world of anime and kava.